welcome back to the IBSP. Here's your host, Foxy New. Jermel Charlo is making excuses. Look, let's break it down honestly and objectively as possible. And Jermel Charlo has come out with a recent interview stating that it's tough to transform his body into the super middleweight division. He states, man, I really don't know that if I'm a 168 pounder yet, 168 is still kind of not like my weight division. It's not easy to make 168. I have to gain weight and gaining weight when you're working really hard is really tough. I could easily walk around at 168. I'm definitely not the naturally bigger fighter. 168 is not my weight division. Now, understand he said something very key there. I am definitely not the naturally bigger fighter. Hone in on that. Now, you got to understand that Jamel Charlo has also done another interview prior to this where he stated that I'm naturally a big guy. I'm not a little guy in any weight differences between me and Canelo is not a problem. But now you're saying I'm definitely not the naturally bigger fighter and it's tough to fight at 168 and make 168. You see the switch up with Jermel Charlo. See, he was just saying I'm naturally a big guy. I'm not a little guy. They don't know my real size. These are all things he said. Now he's saying I'm definitely not the, the naturally bigger guy. And 168 is not my weight division. So you see, this guy's flip-flopping. He's beating around the bush. This is what he's doing. And let's be honest. When you look at Jamel Charlo, Canelo Alvarez, you see this is an interesting fight. But Jamel Charlo is obviously the naturally bigger guy. Not just with the height advantage. Not just with the reach advantage. But even with the weight advantage because he's a naturally bigger man than Canelo. I mean, let's be honest. This is the same Jamel Charlo who's talking about campaigning at 168 if he wins this fight. But you're talking about it's not your weight? It doesn't make any sense. I mean, any idiot knows that Jamel Charlo's a naturally bigger fighter than Canelo Alvarez. He just cuts more weight than Canelo. Let's just be honest and unbiased about it. At the end of the day, you know, we hate to see this from Jamel Charlo, the guy flip-flopping back and forth. This is a fair fight, an even fight, and Jamel Charlo has a lot of advantages. We don't need this type of talk just to make excuses. Because men lie, women lie, but the facts don't lie.